Welcome back to our channel, where we bring you the latest updates and deep dives into the exciting world of space exploration. Today we're turning our attention to a groundbreaking mission that is set to shape the future of lunar exploration, the European Space Agency's ESA Argonaut mission. This mission, aimed at providing Europe with its own autonomous access to the moon, is scheduled to launch in 2031. So settle in as we explore the details of this ambitious project and what it means for the future of space exploration. First, let's take a closer look at the Argonaut mission itself. This robotic lander is designed to carry cargo and scientific instruments to the lunar surface, supporting both human and robotic exploration efforts. The mission represents a significant step forward for ESA, as it seeks to establish a sustainable presence on the moon. With its ability to deliver payloads to virtually any region on the lunar surface, Argonaut is set to become a versatile workhorse for future missions. The Argonaut mission will be launched aboard the Ariane 6 rocket, which recently completed its debut flight after several delays. The Ariane 6 is a powerful rocket, and its successful deployment of the Argonaut lander will mark a major milestone for Europe's space endeavors. This partnership between ESA and the European launch industry highlights the importance of collaboration in achieving ambitious goals in space exploration. One of the key features of the Argonaut lander is its precision landing capability. The spacecraft can touch down with an accuracy better than 330 feet, 100 meters, allowing it to access even the most challenging lunar terrains. This flexibility means that Argonaut can explore and supply resources to virtually any area of interest on the Moon, from the poles to the equatorial regions. In terms of payload capacity, Argonaut is a powerhouse. The lander can carry up to 4,600 pounds, 2,100 kilograms of cargo, including essential supplies such as food, water, and equipment for future astronauts. This capability will be crucial in supporting human missions to the moon, enabling extended stays and more complex scientific investigations. ESA has ambitious plans for the Argonaut mission, with a series of five planned missions throughout the 2030s. Each mission will range from a week to a month in duration, from launch to landing. These missions will not only deliver vital supplies but also deploy scientific instruments and possibly even rovers to conduct experiments and explore the lunar surface. The Argonaut lander is comprised of three main components, the lunar descent element, the payload, and a cargo platform. The lunar descent element is responsible for navigating the spacecraft to the moon and executing a safe landing. The payload can include various scientific instruments, rovers, or other equipment necessary for lunar exploration. Finally, the cargo platform acts as an interface, seamlessly integrating the other two elements and ensuring the efficient deployment of resources. In addition to these capabilities, ESA has teamed up with Florida-based Redwire Corporation to develop a robotic arm prototype for Argonaut. This arm will be instrumental in the lander's operations, enabling it to offload, retrieve, and position objects on the lunar surface. With this robotic arm, Argonaut will have enhanced autonomy and flexibility, paving the way for more sophisticated lunar missions. The target launch date of 2031 was first reported on July 17 by European Spaceflight, highlighting ESA's progress in developing the Argonaut mission. But that's not all. ESA is also exploring innovative technologies that will complement the Argonaut lander and enhance lunar exploration. One such innovation is the European Charging Station for the Moon, a concept that envisions a system launched aboard Argonaut to serve as a gas station on the lunar surface. This station would refuel spacecraft and rovers, extending their operational lifespans and expanding the range of exploration missions. Moreover, ESA is working on the moonlight and navigation and communication capability. This system aims to provide high-speed communication links between the Moon and Earth, as well as with the Gateway Space Station, which NASA is developing as part of its Artemis program. Moonlight would facilitate seamless data transmission, 
enabling real-time communication with astronauts and automated systems on the lunar surface. ESA's collaboration with NASA and other international partners underscores the importance of global cooperation in space exploration. By working together, these agencies can pool resources, expertise, and technology to tackle the challenges of lunar exploration and pave the way for future missions to Mars and beyond. The Argonaut mission represents a bold step forward for ESA and Europe's ambitions in space. With its ability to deliver payloads to any region on the moon, Argonaut will play a vital role in advancing scientific research, supporting human missions, and laying the groundwork for a sustainable lunar presence. So, what does the future hold for Argonaut and European lunar exploration? The successful development and launch of Argonaut will mark the beginning of a new era in space exploration. As Europe establishes its foothold on the moon, we can expect a wealth of scientific discoveries, technological advancements, and international collaboration that will inspire generations to come. In addition to Argonaut, ESA is exploring other lunar initiatives, such as resource utilization and habitat development. By harnessing the moon's resources, such as water ice and regolith, ESA aims to develop sustainable life support systems and construction materials for future lunar bases. These efforts are crucial for enabling long-duration missions and creating a permanent human presence on the Moon. Furthermore, the Argonaut missions will provide valuable data and experience that will inform future exploration endeavors. By studying the Moon's geology, atmosphere, and resources, scientists can gain insights into the formation and evolution of the Earth-Moon system. This knowledge will also aid in planning future missions to Mars and other celestial bodies. As we look to the future, the possibilities for lunar exploration are limitless. With advancements in technology and international collaboration, we are on the cusp of a new era of discovery and innovation. The Moon, once a distant dream, is becoming an integral part of our journey into the cosmos. So mark your calendars for 2031, as the launch of Argonaut promises to be a landmark event in space exploration. Join us as we continue to follow this exciting mission and bring you the latest updates from the world of space science. Thank you for tuning in to today's episode, where we explored ESA's ambitious plans for the Argonaut Lunar Lander. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe to our channel for more space news and updates. Until next time, Keep reaching for the stars and exploring the wonders of the universe.